Alright, so first we have the guppy tank. This is a 140 tall. So it's 48 by 24 by 30. All live plants. And it's filtered by a flu valve 404. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go over here. This is our main fish room right here. That's a female flower horn. And here are the two males. Over here. So a puffer fish is a figure eight puffer. The female bumblebee cichlid. That's our big male jag, he's just in quarantine right now. And this is a little ghost knife fish we bought to grow out. He's for my big community tank. So now, if we move over here to the next stand, we have our convict fries. And then just a, he's a Jack Dempsey, but he's been deformed right there. The MT-55 gallon right here, we're about to set up. And here's my community tank right now. I'm always upgrading sizes. Okay, this is a 6 foot by 18 by 24. I already have the 180 right there, and once they're moved into the 180, I'm going to stack the two 130s and then I'll look into getting an even bigger tank. It's a red catfish, a blood parrot, a red bass stick, some kind of hybrid peacock bass, that's a Calberry peacock bass, three silver dollars. Get a better view from the top, but that's one of the plecos. That's another one. And the smaller pleco is way there. You can't really see it. Right there. Over here is my sump. This is gonna run pretty well all the big tanks all at once. Hundred gallon sump, two 2500 gallon per hour pumps, only one is hooked up right now being utilized, and last but not least for now, it is our convict tank. I believe there's seven convicts in here in total. Uh, 75 gallon. And underneath here is our Oscar tank. It's a 90 gallon. So, that's it right now. We have a turtle. His light burnt out last night. I gotta go get him a new one today.